Peggy 16. Darkspur is a new action RPG game from Maxis, uh, where players build a collection of genetic heroes, each of which has their own unique abilities that can be used in combat. And then you'll organize those heroes into squads. Uh, you'll pick three different characters, put them in the squad, and these characters will have abilities that complement each other. This was really inspired by card games like Magic the Gathering, where you're not really picking up cards that are better than previous cards, you're picking up cards that are more appropriate in different situations. Because every character in Dark Spore has its own unique sets of abilities, they're always valuable. So Magnus is a Quantum Sentinel. Uh, that means he's a tank-like character with an assortment of crowd control abilities. Magnus can push enemies with his kinetic wave ability, pull enemies with his gravity well, and freeze enemies using an ability called Dimensional Rift. Blitz is a Plasma Ravager, and as a Ravager that means he's capable of doing a lot of damage, but he doesn't have much armor to sustain damage done to him. He has an ability called Ride the Lightning, which allows him to teleport in and out of danger. Uh, when he's surrounded by enemies, he can use an ability called Plasma Wreath that damages all the enemies in his immediate vicinity. Having Blitz and Magnus in the same squad uh, lets you have some interesting combo abilities. Magnus can use his Gravity Well to pull a large group of enemy NPCs into Blitz's Plasma Wreath, dealing damage to all of them at the same time. Titan is a Cyber Sentinel. His primary attack is a circular, damaging all the enemies around him. Titan's seismic smash will make sure that he is surrounded by NPCs, and everyone affected by this ability will switch their attack to Titan. Wraith is a Necro Sentinel uh, that controls his enemies in a much different way. His Death's Embrace ability not only inflicts damage, but also frightens NPCs. Wraith's Ghost Form ability gives him an additional 25% chance to dodge enemy attacks, and ensures all ranged attacks pass right through him. When Titan and Wraith are in the same squad, the results are really helpful. Borrowing Wraith's Ghost Form ability shortly after using Titan's Seismic Smash will result in all of the NPCs focusing their fire on a target that's really difficult to hit. So while those NPCs are failing to land their attacks, Titan can then mow them down with his AoE attack. So that's all about organizing heroes into squads and building a collection. We'll have more about the game coming up in other videos.